Clearing out the corruption in your terms, would that mean clearing out the top level federal service workers that are currently at the FDA and the in, CDC? In some categories, I would say. What does that look like? Yeah. yeah. In some categories of workers, there are entire departments like the nutrition departments at FDA that are that have to go, um, that are, are not doing their job. They're not protecting our kids. Why do we have Fruit Loops in this country that have 18 or 19 ingredients, and you go to Canada and it's got two or three? Would you eliminate any of the agencies? I, I'm, no, my, my, to eliminate the agencies, as long as it requires congressional approval, I wouldn't be doing that. But I can get the corruption out of the agencies. This is what I've been doing for 40 years. I've sued all those agencies. I have a PhD in corporate corruption, and that's what I do. And once they're not corrupt, once Americans are getting good science and are allowed to make their own choices, they're going to get a lot of healthier. RFK have been very, very vocal about things like this. And he's coming with Trump right now, and they are saying they are going to make America healthy again. Hopefully they do, but... There is a lot of things that that is being said, and um, how many of these things that are being said would be done, and how many of th these things that we said they will remove, they would remove. You know, most of the time, what we get with politics is our empty promises. Most of the time, but maybe this time will be different. Maybe, but hey, I'm still holding up my air quotes because I don't really believe. <laughs> I, don't really believe I, I don't know. I don't know why I don't really believe it, but. I want to believe it, but I don't really believe it. Hopefully things change. Hopefully things change. And if they don't change, well, you guys know what to do. Thank you guys for listening.